the Hopakon Chiefs wrestling team finished last year 3-21, and third in the Colonial Division, and this year's outlook is not much better. There was only six wrestlers suiting up for the squad this year. For head coach Eric Feyerman, the focus of this year's squad isn't so much team, but getting individuals better heading into the upcoming state tournament. You know, we have Anthony Mastriani to fourth in the region last year. Uh, his goals are high. You know, I, I think he's looking to do well in the state tournament. Um, got to work hard to do that. We got uh, Bart Yaros coming, uh, coming home from Mars Catholic. He's got to sit 30 days, but he, he's a tough kid. I think we can get him over the hump, get him out of the district, see how we can do in the region tournament. Mastriani, who finished last year 32-9, and nine, isn't worried about the team wins. He just wants to get some of the best wrestlers in the room training for the upcoming tournaments. Well, even though we're light in numbers, we still got some decent wrestlers to practice with, so that's always good. Um, you know, we're still working hard with Phage pushing us, so I don't think the numbers are going to interfere with how we do individually. To say the Hopakon Chiefs will struggle this year is a gross understatement. With only six wrestlers suiting up, this team will struggle to win any matches. It is a sad statement of current wrestling that a once-proud team from Hopakon can barely fill the full squad. I'd like for this team to struggle and finish well below 500, but fourth in the Colonial Division. For GardenStateHSWrestling.com, Donald J. Brower, reporting.